What's up, guys? <laughs> hey, Jordan. Hi. Welcome to my YouTube channel, you guys. We are here. Uh, we're gonna be doing a bleach retouch today is the topic. If you guys wanna come in a little bit close here, as you see, there is a band here. No, 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 no. I'm gonna do a bleach retouch on her for you guys, talk to you about all things to do with that. And then after that, we're gonna tone her. I wanna get, she's got some bands in different colors in her hair. So I wanna use the new Sheer Acidic Toners by Matrix actually is what I'm gonna use, the Violet Toner, to cut any unwanted yellow tones. And then I'm gonna hand it over to Philip here, my brother, and he's gonna give her an incredible cut. Right, so we can see here, especially for her face shape here, uh, we're gonna have to lift this shape up a little bit, and that's exactly what we're gonna do. And if you come and zoom up a little closer again, you can see that uh, these ends have probably seen better days. You know, when you're an actress and a model, and you're getting your hair styled day in, day out, all the time, you know, it does take a beating, right? And especially with this much chemical service done on it. So, you're just starting out on YouTube, you guys, so your support would be amazing. Make sure you subscribe. There's gonna be hair tutorials like this. I'm gonna be doing product reviews. I'm gonna be talking to consumers, interviewing people, industry icons, you name it. Anything to do with hair, you're gonna find it here. So I hope you guys subscribe. It's a new journey for me too, so let's go on it together. Enjoy the video. See you soon. Okay guys, let's do this. <laughs> we are now into the bleach application. I am using Light Master by Matrix and I added a bond builder. I use a B3, Brazilian bond builder, um, especially in cases like this. You guys all saw that banding in Jordan's hair. She was really unhappy with it. Usually if I'm doing a bleach retouch, I'm gonna be really careful. Um, I'll probably leave about a quarter of an inch or a little bit less at the root and I'll leave it also going into the hair because bleach expands. Um, and I, I don't want any breakage, but in this case with the banding, there was really no way around it. We needed to treat section by section each area where I saw the banding. In some areas, like you see here, she had more banding. In other areas, not so much. So I really went through her hair like with a fine tooth comb and you know, uh, overlapped, which is something I normally don't do, on the areas where I saw the yellow and the banding in her hair from previous, uh, you know, different colors that she's had in her hair. She's a model, actress, and, you know, her hair just really needed a complete makeover. She wanted to have a beautiful platinum. Um, so I'm going in here, and as you see, section by section, just really treating that. I only use 20 volume, you guys with the Bond Builder. Um, I love B3 because it's not water-based, it's oil-based. So the volume that you use is the volume that you're gonna get and it's one step. Um, this was something that I just had to watch really, really carefully. Um, I didn't want any breakage in her hair. I wanted to make sure that her hair was completely intact and I wanted it to be healthier at the end um, than it was in the beginning. So I was very careful going back through, if you notice, just really spot checking, making sure that I'm getting every single one of these bands. I was really kind of, I was treating this like a color correction because really that's what it is. Um, when there's banding in the hair and it's different in every area, it is something that can take a really long time and she you know, tried numerous times to have it corrected. So um, we really wanted to get it right this time. Um, so Light Master Matrix, there's, uh, I was using the one, the eight level lift. They have different additives. They have an oil additive for on scalp, and they also have a clay additive for balayage. If you notice right here, I'm checking her hair, and I got rid of that band. I was so happy. This was about 20 minutes later. Uh, we got to the level that we wanted, and it was time to go in and do a bleach wash. I wanted to make sure that there was no room, so I added some water, dropped that down to 10 volume, and added Matrix Total Results Color Care Shampoo to her hair with more B3 Brazilian Bomb Builder and worked it in her hair for just about five minutes, really, really watching her hair. And then it was time to tone. We wanted to do a smoked out root with real, real beautiful platinum ends. So what I did is I used two new toners by Matrix. They have new fast toners. They come in anti-brass, anti-yellow, um, anti-red. And what we use is the anti-brass toner because we really wanted to smoke that out. And then we came back in with the new sheer acidic violet toner, which is another new toner. Um, and we overlapped that over the base and put it all over her ends and let it process for 10 minutes. Uh, we really wanted to have like a beautiful smoky base, kind of a shadow root going into an icy white platinum. Um, we were really, really happy with the results. Philip came in with his shears. You guys are always asking me what he uses. He uses the Wolf shear, they're his own shears. If you go to his page on Instagram, the link is in his bio. 
And he just wanted to trim her ends, as he said earlier. And he just wanted to give her a beautiful, like, lob haircut with a beautiful shape. Just healthy, get rid of any dead ends, and just give her a new shaping. Um, a lot of you guys were asking me on my Instagram video that I posted, like, why did we want the darker root? Uh, sometimes when you have banding, for me, I'd rather go in with something like the anti-brass toner and have that be a smoked out root because when she washes her hair a few times, that's gonna fade beautifully into the platinum that you see here. Uh, Jordan actually loved the darker root and she actually didn't wanna wash her hair. She wanted it to stay in her hair. So, um, you know, we, we really actually liked that look. There's Philip blow drying with the power styler. Nobody blow dries like Philip. Look at that shine and how healthy Jordan's hair was after this. Um, her hair felt like silk. It just felt really, really amazing. And we got that really ice white platinum that she was looking for. Um, smoothed out her hair. We loved the look of her hair straight. Um, we were really happy with the color. Jordan was thrilled, which was obviously always the best feeling. We always want our guests to be happy. Um, and it was time we decided to do some curls. So uh, using the Hot Tools Pro one and a quarter inch iron, you guys, there's really nothing like this out there. I love this iron. Philip uses it a lot and he just wanted to put some really beautiful loose texture in Jordan's hair. We thought it would be fun to just give the finished look with some texture and bounce and just really, really show off the color. If you notice the way he's twisting his iron to give it that texture. Um, Philip always lets the hair sit. He'll usually put his favorite texture spray. It's usually a texture builder by Matrix. And he'll let it sit in the hair and just cool down for a little bit. And then he'll go for it and break it apart. And now it is time for the magic. <laughs> One thing I see is people sometimes seem to be afraid to break up curls. Don't be afraid, you guys. Once the curls have set and cooled, I always feel it looks better when you mess it up. Don't be afraid. Work your hands in there. Work your fingers. Work your magic and make that beautiful finished look as you see that Philip is doing here. We were so happy with this look and Jordan was thrilled as you see here. She was like grinning from ear to ear. Uh, <laughs> that's always the best feeling, right? Happy client, happy stylist. Uh, we love doing this collaboration. I hope that you enjoyed this, you guys. Please make sure that you hit the subscribe button and subscribe to my channel. There will be videos like this coming your way all the time. Thank you for watching and make sure you subscribe to Philip too. See you guys soon.